Hey, welcome. In this lecture, we are going to be able to display our banners over here. Okay. Now, to do this, we have to head back to our VS Code. And we cannot close this, so we can just leave it this way. And head up to upload underscore banner screen. And first of all, right after the row widget, we want to have a divider divider and within the divider it has a property known as color and this is going to be colors dot gray and now what you have to do is to use control and s to save to save this file and within the terminal use harrow to perform hot restart and go check this out and now you can see it over here great and we can just go ahead now we can have the container and it's going to take in test widget and this is going to say banners banners and also we can start this and have the test size and we can give a font size to make this bigger and also we can make this border font width and font width dot bold okay great use control next to save and this is going to be in the center and what we can do is within the container we can then have the alignment and alignment widget and top left control next to save and within the terminal arrow to perform auto start and you can see it over here sorry and we can wrap this with a pardon to give some written space and also pardon okay great remember we can't close this i think this is a punishment okay and Within the widgets, we can then create a new file. New file, and we can call this banner widget dot dot. And it's going to be similar to that of the category widget. So basically, we can alight and control and C to copy. And we can then paste this over here. And first of all, we have to rename this. A light use control and D to alight it to a light similar and this is gonna be burner and widget okay and the name of the collection we want to fetch our data from is I think we called it burners okay and burners and we can end this variable to say to say banner sorry banner okay banners stream and paste it over here okay control next to save and we just want to display the image okay and get rid of this test widget we do not have that and you can see over here we have a variable called category data to store our category data and what we can do is we can rename this to banner data banner data and this is going to be banner data okay let's go check to see what we call that field okay we called it image so it is correct image seems good and use control s to save now and back to the burn upload burner upload burner right after the pardon we can then call the burner widget hmm. our spelling is wrong we can just correct this control d burner 
we get and I'm just gonna get rid of this and banner we get and use control s to save and control s to save this also and now within the terminal we can then say r and see performing auth restart we just have to wait for this and hopefully we are not going to get any errors for sure and i think it's done and we can go check this out and banner upper banner and you can see it's trying to fetch it now and some score and you can see we have up to one two three four five six that is the cross access count and if we upload a new banner we can just upload a new burner upload a new burner maybe maybe it's stoner okay and save and log into the customer app and you're gonna see all this banner displayed over there yeah, seems cool. Everything is working as expected.